Ooh, that's that's not too much. So he's lighting up the Turkish league. Is Haji Wright ready for the Premier League in your eyes? So in the eyes of many, the Premier League is the Mecca, right? Yeah. Right. Yes, no? Oh, yeah. I, yeah, without a doubt. Unless no. you're talking about, like, five other clubs in the world that you might Correct. say. Over at Crystal Correct. Palace, you know, your, Absolutely. your top teams in Spain, Germany, Absolutely. Italy, But and as Crystal a league, Palace as a is league, a Premier very league. attractive setup. Why? Well, they're in, they're in London. Yes. Okay, you're in a good spot of England. Uh, historic club. Very ambitious. Coach a lot of players can relate to. Yeah. And I think... It's in the eye of the hurricane. If you're in any of those English clubs uh, in London, it's a good platform for bigger and better. It just is. It's a reality. I don't want to lump him into a physicality caliber. Right. Greg Berhalter said he's his physical forward, his profile being a physical forward. I think he's just a good forward. Okay. I don't think he was put in positions to succeed with the U.S. men's national team. I don't think any nine was put in positions to succeed with the U.S. men's national team. But he's got two seasons where he's been absolutely lighting up, absolutely grabbing the attention of a lot of people. He's a player that has speed, that's good at scoring goals with his head, right foot, left foot, good movement, has decent hold up, has decent link up play. Mm -hmm. Scoring goals has not been the issue for him. Not it's in about multiple putting, leagues as you see there. Yes, it's about putting him in a situation to get those opportunities. I do think in a league like the English Premier League, you're gonna have those opportunities. Okay. You may be on the losing side, Sometimes, yeah. because you're going to be in a huge club, a massive club, but you're going to have those opportunities. Oh, you mentioned the manager, uh, obviously, Patrick Vieira. Let me ask you this, because I see that price tag, yeah. 10 million euros. We know how much money is involved in the Premier League. If they're buying a guy for 10 million euros, I don't know that they see him as an immediate starter. Right. It's not, I think it's not they, a huge price tag. No, no, no by any means. No. Um, so that tells me that he's more of a long-term project or maybe a backup in terms of what they're thinking his role would be. Is that what's best for him? Like, hey, even if my minutes go down, I'm going from Turkey to the Premier League. If I have to sit the bench for a half season or a season and a half, I'm still getting better because I'm in a better... Is he 22, 23 years old? What I like about him is that when he's been on the field, he's produced. So if you're a forward, you can't cool down. You have to right. stay hot. Right. So he's got to go where he thinks he can play. If that avenue to success, to playing time, he thinks is in Crystal Palace, and there's a project presented to him where he sees that avenue, then take it. If not, you've got to go somewhere where you can continue to play, continue to develop. Because, listen, in that moment that you're still trying to continue to develop and score goals, guess who else is scoring goals? Josh Sargent. Right. Guess who else is scoring goals? Ricardo Pepe. Guess who else is scoring goals? Jordan Pipa. Guess who else is scoring goals? A Brandon Vasquez. Guess who else may be scoring goals and in the eye of it still Greg Berhalter? Right. It's Jesus Ferreira. Right. So there's a long laundry list of players who are scoring goals, so you have to make sure, this goes for every player if you're that pool, especially in the nine position, that wherever you go, you're scoring goals. So he's 24 years old, and I think the, the point we always have to remember is the concentration of games, yeah. especially in England, because there's not just the league, there's the cup, and there's the league cup. There's all sorts of tournaments. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't necessarily see Palace in the European theater, but you never know what could happen. You never know. You never know what could happen. So I think... Conference league. Even if he's not a you know, starting 11 in the Premier League guy, there's probably still some starts and minutes there for him. And, and as he's shown and goal elsewhere, scores are attractive. whenever he's prove, on the field, hey, he so does produce. If you can prove that you can score yep. goals at whatever rate at a club like Crystal Palace, bigger and better come knocking.